Hi, hello everyone, it's only one gamer, and welcome back to the Terraria Let's Play. This is part 9, I do believe, after our frightful fight with the Aegathuhu. This part is mainly just gonna be recovery. We're gonna be recovering and uh, building a little bit of uh, something that w Green slime, what are ya doing? Whoops, I did not mean to use my grappling device, but this green slime thought it was gonna do some assassination drop on me. Ha! Huh. Well, <laughs> it failed. So, I hope everyone's having an absolute brilliant day out there. And, uh, yeah, we did fail on killing the Aikathuhu last part, but that is okay, because we will eventually come back to him and pwn his face when I am, like, boss, and I'll probably just come back and, like, one-hit him. That's how strong I'm probably gonna wait till I am. What am I doing? I need my dirt blocks. Um, okay, what is going on? As you guys know, um, I've stated, I've, I've been using a broken controller for a long time, and, like, the analog stick, the... L2, R2 are just really messed up, and I just have never bought another controller, because, like, it isn't, like, to the point that it's messed up that I need a new controller, but it's, like, it's pretty messed up, and that might have been why I lost the Ion Cthulhu boss fight, so, yeah, not uh, a very awesome thing indeed, but, hey, it is what it is. Oh, da, 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 let's see what basically what I want to do in this part. I just want to build a little hut here and you guys may be like well, Why you want to build a hut? Uh, well, I want to uh, you know build a little hut that goes down uh, To that underground cave so I don't have to hop all the way over that mountain each time just to get in that cave Because that's really like my main cave. I always go down. What is that bunny? The bunny's down there But yeah, I, I just want a quicker way close to my house to get down in the cave and Because uh, I always go to that cave to get ores and just resources in general so you know it's just i'm just gonna go ahead and make me a little hut here uh perhaps i just make it out of stone uh nah nah we'll make we'll make the wall out of stone possibly nah yeah uh, yeah why not might as well it for now at least and I do believe it just needs to be like so, and uh, we'll put two doors here, even though I could probably just jump over this, but hey, it is what it is. And of course, we'll put our necessities like a, a workbench and stuff like that in here, which I'll go ahead and craft. Here we go. Uh, my inventory is like all messy right now. I really need to organize it a little bit more and get things, you know, uh, organized. Uh, okay, now let's just go ahead and make a door. Put that one there, and make another door, and put that over here. Now, of course, we're going to be digging down, like, right here. I only need, like, two. Of course, the water is going to make this difficult. Uh, whatever. It'll slowly go away. So, and then I just need some platforms. I'm going to need quite a bit of platforms, so I'm going to go ahead and make a good bit of these in advance. And, uh, oh, yeah, I need some wooden walls as well. That would... Be beneficial and I need a wooden floor as well I guess so yeah I'm gonna have to destroy the bench and the doors uh, why didn't I think about that well anyhow yeah this I I kind of just want to um you know slowly what it I would why is it? yeah yeah I need I need oh my gosh stop going crazy oh I got seven lens awesome so if I do want to fight the Aikathu again I can Alright, so this actually is not looking bad because I think it only takes like six lenses to make, um, crap, well, I don't, I don't need that tombstone, like, well, I've dropped it, but okay, I guess, but, um, yeah, like I was saying, I, I only need, like, um, six lenses to make a suspicious looking eye, I might be wrong there, but I think that's all I need, so I could actually, uh, fight the eye of Cthulhu here soon, what do you guys know about that, I would not have expected that, huh? So, yeah, I can fight it again whenever I please, and I'm probably going to wait a while. Like, what I'm going to do, I'm going to take a few parts and episodes of just relaxing, kind of like adding some more onto our world here, and just prepare it a little bit more for him. And I'm probably going to make my arena off further away from my NPCs this time. Of course, then if I die, I can't come back and get my stuff, but I honestly don't know. I think I am going to move the uh, uh, the little arena somewhere else probably like over the hill over here over in that direction so yeah, I'm probably gonna move this make it a lot more better and a lot more presentable for fighting the Aikathuhu and I'm really gonna go all out next time we fight him guys I I know next time we will defeat him like without a doubt cuz I'm not accepting defeat cuz I'm gonna put everything into winning the next time um, I kinda had a feeling that I was not gonna win last time and well I didn't and it was just uh, it is what it is. Uh, I, some things got a little messed up and whatnot. I don't know if it was my fault I lost or my controller's fault. But 
Me and my controller opposed to work as a team, but he did not want to that day, so sad indeed. But yeah, we're making our little hut here, and let's see. Da, 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 da. And then we're make some wood walls. Yeah, so I like the wood walls. Um, okay, that's our, our little hut's pretty much done. It's, uh, you know, it's different. We're going with it, so let's go ahead and just dig this, like so. Alright, and it looks like we're about to enter the cave. Oh, well, I, you know what, so we'll just grapple our way up here. Oh, I need to go up. Nope, you keep on going. Okay, there we go. Thank you very much. Um, Let's see here. We need to go to our wooden platforms. All right. Uh, okay, did you guys just see what I just did? Absolutely genius. I I don't know how I even managed to do that either. But, hey, uh, you know. You, oh, come on. I'm. Oh, come on. Why am I having such a problem? I gotta organize this cave better and make it a little bit more easier to walk around and etc. Nope. Okay, thank you. Now, let's do this. There we go. And, uh, nope. Okay, yep, okay, good. Um, now what am I, okay, can I place this, like, right here? Will that work? Okay, can, all right, yes, yes, that's, that's okay, now that's good, we're good. Now I just gotta figure out what to do from here. Um, I didn't think this far ahead. It looks like I'm in a bit of a dilemma now. Now, uh, where's my dirt blocks? Uh, I, what is going on here? I don't have no dirt. Oh, yeah, there they are, 75. I was like, okay, I'm overlooking it, so that's just brilliant. Uh, we'll go ahead and lower this down, like so. Yep. Oh, all right. Base mode. Epic building skills for the win. Not really, guys, but okay. And we'll probably put, like, one right here. Why not? All right, that don't look bad. All right, I can roll with it. It don't have to be perfect, so here we go. Alright, and then we can just drop down on this little platform here, and, uh, continue our journey, yeah? And I don't know why, but I want to make this place look a little bit nice. Um, I don't want many things spawning down here. I will put a torch, like, on this side, and on this side, and light it up a little bit. So, yeah, now we have a quicker way and a quicker access to our cave, which is beneficial. Um, looking at our map here... You guys will tell, we, uh, we have explored quite a bit of this cave, so we've went all the way down there. It's quite insane, actually, and there's actually a, that cave right underneath, near our house, which goes all the way down to the netherworld, almost, so, because, like, that's the bottom of the world there, so, well, we have done quite a bit of exploration, but, wait a second, why is that what? Um, is, is that snow? What is that? I've, I don't know why it's white over there, but it's kind of making me curious. Like, I don't know. Is it, is it a snow biome? I've never encountered a snow biome. I don't, well, you know, made me curious. Now, I'm going to go check that out and do some more exploration. We have not run into no corruption yet, I don't think. So, that's quite shocking to me because usually the corruption is something that, uh, you know, makes us, oh, come on. Oh, yep. Yeah, okay, good. We made it. All right, on we go. We don't really need a torch out. I always have to hotkey my stuff. Okay, there we go, there we go, and there we go. Thank you. Now, we're going to make our way over there before it gets dark. As you guys can tell, it's already getting dark, so we don't want to die. But uh, as long as it's not Blood Moon, I think we should be able to survive in the dark. The zombies and stuff is not going to be too big of a threat towards us, so that's a yay there. Apparently, woo, don't want to fall down. I have been over here. Okay. I have indeed been here. Um, for when? I, I think it was a few parts back. I went exploring a little bit, but what do I... Oh, no, really? Are you serious? It's a snow biome. Wow. That's what that, uh, when I was in the caves, I heard the different sound. This is a snow biome, guys. Wow. I've never in all my time playing Terraria found a snow biome. This is awesome. Oh, wow. So, yeah, this is, I. Uh, you know, we didn't defeat the Aikathu, but we found this, which is awesome. Wow. I want to make, like, a house here or something. Like, Oh, and then it goes right into the corruption. Yep. That's, I've never seen that happen. A snow biome that goes right into the corruption. And the, man, that thing's going to, all right, bring it, bring it. I'm not, I'm not getting near the corruption, but I will kill that thing if it comes near me. I can take you on. I almost killed the Ayakathu. I am not afraid of anything. 
Except, like, I know there's a boss called, like, Skeletron, which is, like, really hard, so I, I don't even know about fighting that, but... Is this a snow block? Yeah, snow blocks! Awesome! I'm gonna give me a few snow blocks just for the lols, and to have, and put back at our place for no reason. Just, uh, this is cool, guys. I, I am quite happy about finding a snow biome. Um, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't even know, like, they were even implemented in the game, really, because I never found one on the PC version, and... Well, this is the first time finding one on the console version, so, yeah, that's that's awesome. A great way to spice up this part. It's dark now, though, so we want to head back and get to mining in our cave. And uh, we found the corruption in this part as well, so definitely a lot has been done. So that is beneficial indeed. So I don't know how far away we are from the house. I think it's just right over this hill, and then we should be near, possibly. No, oh. Oh, I see some iron glowing in the cave down there. Have we been in this cave? Hmm, I don't know. Let me drop down and kill this slime. Light up this area. I would like to find an underground jungle. That would be absolutely awesome. Um, well, it looks like we started out exploring and uh, found a snow biome. I wondered what that was. I seen it and I was like, we gotta go check that out. So checking the map is beneficial sometimes, guys. It really is. And I'm just gonna gather this copper here. And whatnot. And there's also a copper coin right there. And I want to get in that cave over there. So I'm going to dig my way over there and see what is lurking over there besides that iron. Because I will take that iron. Uh, iron is really good. And I probably could use it for something. I already got iron armor. But I more importantly need goat. Oh, I've been down here before. Is this where the... Um, Back on, like, part, I don't even know what part it was. But the... Yeah, this was, this was it. Like, the uh, demon eyes almost killed me. Because I was coming back and I was weak. Oh, yeah, I remember that all too well. And I, I blocked it up so it couldn't get to me. All right, so that's cool. Um, we'll go and go ahead and get this iron and then probably just go ahead and head back. And I want to fully explore. Actually, this connects with the cave uh, that we made a little hut to go under. Like, all the caves connect. It's kind of strange and odd. And now I see the zombie. He thinks he's going to sneak up on me. Get away. Are you for real, bro? You thought you was going to sneak up on only one gamer? No, not gonna happen. All right, so don't think we need down in that cave yet, but I will go light it up a little bit. So, oh, I see some cobwebs. I will take them because we can make more silk, and I don't know what else we need silk for, but it might be beneficial. Wow, this actually, all right, well, I said I was gonna go back, but never mind, guys. I got a little, oh, wait, no, I don't. Well, I did not want to put that many torches down, but whatever. Uh, green slime over there swimming in some water, so it looks like. Whoa. Oh, a chest. Have I... I think I've got this chest. I've had to have. Haven't I? No, I haven't. Wow. Awesome. An aglet, which is equipable and increases my speed by 5%. I will indeed take that and equip that right now. Oh, so I can put it in like any of my equipment. Okay, yeah. And uh, of course we get some more grenades and some silver coins and shurikens, which will be helpful, and a swiftness potion. All right, just take it all. Well, I can't take it all because my inventory is full. I don't need that. Don't need clay blocks. I probably do need clay bo blocks, but eh, not as now. I got one piece of silk. Um, all right, yeah, we can go ahead and take this. Go. All right, now I'm going to get my hammer out right there and uh, go ahead and take this. So yeah, that was awesome. I'm surprised I had, had not found that. Perhaps I have not been down here. Intriguing. I see some copper and possibly silver up there. All right. Well, we might as well go give this a check. I mean, it, it's going to be... Oh, wow, look at all the copper. All right, well, a lot of copper. I'm not going to worry about getting that right now because I'm kind of just wanting to explore this really quickly, see what this has to offer, and what not um okay so you know that's uh that's pretty cool oh some gold hey i want the gold i will take the gold awesome there's not much of it but hey it's a little bit whoops well that's what i was holding on to all right but yeah it's not much but hey what little we can get is awesome and i will take it and it's like okay that's just sand all right sweet all right well let's get on out of here and uh we might come back and do some more expo Dang it, I was wanting to be smart. Okay, yeah, I definitely want to come back to this and whatnot. And I'm kind of, I should go ahead and get that copper shit, I guess. All right, well, we'll do it. I was debating whether I wanted to yet or not, but I think I've been over there with them slimes or possibly. I don't know. Like, I've been so many places down here, I honestly don't even know, guys. I, that's why I'm going to start 
lighting up everywhere I've been, so I kind of know. Because I used to just not really use my torches. Yeah, I see something lit up over there, so must have been over there. All right, so let's go ahead and get out of here, and we will sum this part up. Come on, grab a hold of something. Thank you. And, yeah, but we're going to sum this part up, so I hope you guys enjoyed this little part of, like, recovering from uh, the loss of the fight. But that's okay, because we're going to come back and defeat him eventually, because we have uh, enough lenses to make a suspicious-looking eye again, I do believe. Um, I might go ahead and make that in this part, but I'm not exactly sure. Okay, yeah, yeah, all right. We're going to be able to get back a lot quicker than I thought. Oh, the grappling hook is, like, one of the best things ever in this game. I, I cannot tell you guys enough. Go. Okay, thank you. Now we're going to head back quickly, very swiftly. And, um, oh, wow, that's that's brilliant. All right. And I'll just use this, my, my new hut that I made to hop up there real quick. I actually like this. I think it was a great thing we made. And uh, I like building on this game. I don't know. It's rather, rather relaxing and fun. So my tombstone lies over there. But we're just going to leave that there for now. And this demonite is coming after me. No. Go, go, go. Oh, yeah. All right. The arena got it. Go. Go in the door. Shut it. All right. Ha. All right. We're good. Now, what was I going to do? I forgot. Uh, let's look here. In crafting. And see what it takes to. Oh, I can make more silk. Might as well do that. Uh, what did I just make? Um, I thought I actually didn't leave. I did! I made a red banner on accident! Oh, come on! Really? Ah, oh, why does this have to happen? I knew... It was, it was bound to happen eventually. It was indeed. Yeah, we got a banner now. And a lot of stuff I gotta put in a chest here. We also got another chest. We need to expand... Oh, yeah, the statues! We gotta work on the statue room as well. And some of the future parts. So, yeah, we're probably going to do a lot of renovating and preparing. And then eventually, we're going to come back to the Eye of Cthulhu and fight him again once we have, you know, became stronger. Um, Let's see, what's in this chest? Just, like, some casual stuff. Okay, I'll put put uh, my grenades in there yeah, with the other grenades and whatnot. So, yeah, I'm going to organize the inventory and stuff. And I will catch you guys in the next part. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for all the support. And, uh... I will keep this series running strong as long as you guys keep on supporting. This is Only One Gamer, signing out.